Okay guys, so we have another um, huckster here in his bathrobe, all his glory on his throne, speaking to a bunch of peasants on yoga mats that are just looking at him for, fa for uh, salvation and answers. This uh, video is called Universe Always Works With You, Everything Will Come To You, okay? So again, I'm doing this because, look, he's going to, again, it's word salad. He puts a bunch of talking points together, a bunch of sentences together, and just scrambles it all up. Um, this, and, and basically, this is a four-minute video that can, he could have summed it down in probably two sentences for his followers. Um, if he was a true leader or a master and trying to help people instead of fucking distract and confuse and bamboozle people. So listen to this shit. This is his answer. And this is on his website. He has almost 2 million followers. He's been on the circuit for years and years. Probably close to billions of views. Millions of people look at him for salvation. Um, and listen. Listen to how he talks. This is what people are listening to. Guys. With you. To every speech that you make, to every action that you take. And they help you. Cut it completely. Oh my God. And there it goes. There you go. That's the beginning. So the universe is going to give you answers. Everything you say. Oh my God. I mean, here we go. There's no going back. Yeah, no going back. It's very important for everybody to have time for real self. Not in the chaos <laughs> okay. Take time for yourself, guys. Okay. Conversations with loads of different people about things, about your problems and your challenges. Now. Yeah. Don't talk about your problems and challenges to people. Okay. Time for yourself. Now, over the next 72 hours. Look at this. Look at all of these people. Look at that girl. She's like, what the fuck is this guy wearing his bathrobe for? These people are so, you know, but I could be, that could be me, you know, 10 years ago, 15 years ago, that could be me sitting behind this woman right here, you know, but I would have been sitting there going, excuse me, raise my hand, interrupting this dumbass and been like, could you say that again? Could you repeat that again? So what are you trying to say? But no, these people just eat it up, suck it in. Powers, you are having time for yourself. To get clarity. What do I really want? Because deep down in the core you know what you really want. Deep down in the core you also know what you don't want. What you no longer want in your life. So in the course of the last minute. He has told you that you know what you want. You know what you do want. And the universe gives you everything. But you cut the cord. What the fuck? And the only problem is the human emotional attachment mind. But you know the <laughs> That's the only problem. Think about that. The only problem in your life is your own human emotional attachment mind. It has nothing to do with your outside, what's going on around you. And so you know if something is working. You know if something is not working. You know if something is what you really want. You know if something is not quite what you really want. You know. So... What does this mean? It means that... <laughs> what does it mean? Phone one energies are here to help you, to assist you. Hold on. So you're telling me everything he just said means that full moon energies are here to help you and assist you? How the hell would I have came to that conclusion unless he just told me what the fuck he just said meant? How will full moon energies have anything to do with this? If you have the courage to take that action... And you observe, and you see how it works as magic again. Certain things will happen, and then it suddenly becomes a case in three days' time. There's no going back. If anybody can make sense of that, I mean, guys, it, it is a stretch of my fucking... I've listened to this video now probably ten times. It is a stretch. I'm, I'm trying. I know there's certain talking points and points he's trying to make here and there, and but he's just putting a whole bunch of shit together.
And what will happen? Well, months, months will pass by now. Months, months will pass by as I, as I fucking throw word salad at you and confuse and distract you and you continue to follow me and, oh my God, man. I mean, this is crazy. People, this is what people, who they put their trust in for their afterlife when they're dead. Months, maybe years, I don't know. He doesn't know. Neither do they. One foot is in and one foot is out. One is a maybe, one is a yes, one is a no. <laughs> 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 this motherfucker's got three feet. One is a yes, one is a maybe, one is a no. Oh my god. This is all in your head. All this conflict is in your head. This is... <laughs> <laughs> this must be all... Uh, my whole issue with him is in my head. It's my alignment. That's what it is. It's my alignment. You in alignment? Are you in misalignment? Are you in misalignment? If you in misalignment, tell me. Okay, you predict your future for me. What you manifest. If you recognize one foot is in, one foot is out. One is yes, one is maybe, one is no. All at the same time. Every day it keeps interchanging. He is literally just taking people out in the woods. And they're following him, and he's like juking and jiving around the trees. And I mean, this is crazy. He is taking you for a ride right now. Look how happy he is. This is his game. This is his realm, guys. You don't understand. This is nonsensical bullshit to anybody with a thinking mind. But there are people, millions of people, literally, that put their trust, faith, hope, and everything in this man. And will defend him to the death while he sits there and bamboozles them and enjoys the pleasures of this life. Misalignment, tell me what do you manifest? Continue to manifest chaos. But one thing you do need to realize is this like everything in life, as nature has it. Is <laughs> there you go. There's a look, and he pulls his shoulder. I mean, that's so uncomfortable. They know what they're saying. They know what they're doing. They're telling you that your pain is temporary. No matter what system you were born into, how much abuse, you know, what kind of government, whatever that you were born into, your pain is temporary. Now listen to this. Everything shall pass. Everything. Everything. Doesn't matter what happens. Doesn't matter. It'll always pass. No shit. No fucking shit. We've been listening to this guy for almost four minutes to give us an answer on how the universe is going to work with me and everything's going to come to me. And you're telling me that my pain's going to pass. What the fuck is he talking about? Guys, this isn't just some random. This isn't somebody that did this and put this up of his shit. This is on his, this idiot's fucking page. He put this out seven hours ago for his followers to help enlighten them. This is his enlightenment. So what does that mean? It may be a case that your human side of yourself feels emotional about the situation, feels the attachment about the situation, remembers all the memories of the situation and everything, you know, so it's attachment. So your human side will play up. But you need to understand that change is the only constant human world, the change is the only constant. When time passes, time itself is healing. <laughs> this is crazy, guys. This is a narrative. When space is cleared, they are trying to distract you. You have blank canvas. This guy's a blank canvas. This is fucking ridiculous, man. This guy is sickening. Look at him. Oh my God. Did you see that? Did you see that? Oh my God. I got to go back. Hold on. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see if I can pause it real quick. You have blank canvas. Blank canvas. Oh my God. So there you go. Um, 
universe always works with you. This is this is what he put out today. Universe always works with you. Everything will come to you. So you figure you're going to listen to that and figure out how the universe is going to work with me and how I'm going to manifest. And all he told you was just a whole bunch of bullshit. It's just, it, it, look, oh my God, I don't even know. I mean, guys, I would love to hear what you think. Um, as far as I'm concerned, this is a in-your-face agenda. And if an adult is sitting there listening to this and they have kids at home that go to school and they their kids don't like school, this is why. Because their, their teachers are doing the same shit to them, guys. Their teachers are double-speaking and talking in circles and acting like they have keys to knowledge. And they're ju it's just a bunch of bullshit. We're propping up a bunch of idols and gurus and, and masters and anything, saviors, anything we can because we're so afraid to face ourselves.